we are have facing discrimination in different ways. We have huge problems in the government data. It's not accurate and we have problems about knowing the number of black people dying. Some studies made by the Catholic University tested that like black and poor people sometimes are three times more likely to die from COVID-19. So we have like people being infected, white and black people, but the, the white people are surviving more and black people are dying more. The black population is more vulnerable socially. Like we still have to face police brutality. We still have to face inequality in many different ways and now hunger and poverty and the COVID-19. So nothing stops. So we continue struggling in every level and still have something on top of it. So it's very terrifying. I feel particularly desperate sometimes and hopeless, but then I have to go back to history and to understanding that, you know, human rights is not an easy agenda. It came out of a lot of struggle and we will keep on fighting. We don't have any other choice. Fighting is our existence. That is no reason for us to be here if not the fight of our ancestors. We will keep on fighting. We were supposed to fight for affirmative action and we are fighting for food distribution now, for minimum wage now. So some things that we thought that we already achieved, we might lose. So we need to keep on fighting. It's our only way 